Hello everyone, welcome back, Crown Geek here. Now for many of you, 15 gigabyte of Google Drive space is not enough to store all your data as all the Google photos, email attachment and everything gets saved in the same Google Drive only. But today in this video, I will be sharing an amazing trick to get unlimited space in your Google Drive for absolutely free. So if you are really tired of the Google Drive full space and want to enjoy the more storage for absolutely free, then make sure that you do not skip any part of this video. Now generally Google says that in order to upgrade your storage, you need to go with their paid plan where you have to pay a good amount for 30 gigabyte, 100 gigabyte, 200 gigabyte of space. But no need to worry as I promised you that I will be giving you a very amazing trick that will be helping you to get the unlimited or 150 gigabyte of storage. So without wasting any further time, let's quickly get started. So what you will have to do, you will have to create multiple Google Drive account. Like if you need 60 gigabyte of storage, then you will have to create four Google account. And if you need 120 GB of storage, then you will have to create eight Google account. Now you might be thinking that why I'm sharing this and old and the foolish trick with you. And everybody know that you will be getting 15 gigabyte of storage with one account. So if you create multiple account, then uh, you will be getting 15 into 4, 15 into 8 and then you have to log in with different Google account in order to enjoy the storage. No, this is not the trick. The trick is that you would be able to manage all the storage from one Google account only. And that is the reason I'm telling you that do not skip the video. So now let's see how exactly this is going to happen. Now first you will have to come to your primary account. Like this one is my primary account and you can see that I have 1.83 gigabyte or 15 gigabyte used. And I have created four different Google account here. I have four Google account. So what you will have to do, you need to keep your primary account as it is. So you don't have to do anything on your primary account where you want to extend the storage. What you have to do, click on the profile picture at the right and top and copy your email address. Once copied, now you have to go to another Google account that you have created. And here you have to click on new, click on new folder. And you have to rename this folder. So I will type here account one. And in the bracket, I can type the amount of storage available on this account. So around 14 gigabyte of storage is available. So I will type 14 so that I can identify and click on create. And once the folder get created, now you have to make a right click on it. Or up to share. Click on share. Now it will ask you add people group or calendar event. So here you have to type the email of your primary account that we just copied. All right, so just paste the email here. Once pasted on the right hand side, make sure that it's being selected to editor so that you should have all the permission. And that's it, click on send. All right, so once it's been shared, now you will have to come to your primary account. And from the left hand menu option, you will have to click on shared with me. And you will find here the new account, the new folder that we just created on our different Google account. It's been shared with the primary account and so on. You have to do the same thing from the different Google account. So let me quickly do on all of them. So I will go to the second Google account. I will click on new folder. This one I will name account two. And in the bracket, I have here around 14.5 gigabyte space available. So I will type 14.5 and click on create. Once created again, I will right click on it. Hover up to share, click on share and type the email here of my primary account and I will make sure it's been selected to editor and click on send. Then I will go to my third Google account, click on new, click on new folder and this one I will name account three and in the bracket I will type 15 because I have almost all the space available here and click on create. Then I will go to the fourth account, click on new, click on new folder and rename it to account four and the space is around 14.3 gigabyte. So I will type it and click on create. As of now, I'm only taking four Google account here, but if you want the more storage, then you have to create more Google account. And this you have to do only for one time. And now this time, if you come to your primary account, so you will find that the four account, four folder has been shared over here. So now what will happen? 
you have this 15 gigabyte of storage from this primary account a part of that you have 14.3 gigabyte 15 gigabyte 14.5 and 14 gigabyte of storage so you can bring it up and you can use the storage here and this storage will be different will not be taking any space of this 15 gigabyte so i will be uploading a small video in this folder so what i'm going to do i will be adding a new video here in this folder and you have to keep an eye here that the storage that we have around 1.83 gigabyte will not be going to increase because this video will be uploading in this folder that we shared and this folder is basically we are utilizing the space of another google account from one google account only all right so let me upload a video here and you will find that the storage will not be going to increase even if i refresh it this is going to remain 1.83 gigabyte only because we are using a different google account folder here all right so this way you can use the 15 gigabyte of space that you get on your primary account a part of that you can create multiple google account depending how much space you need you can go to that different google account create a folder and share with your primary account and all these folders will be displayed in your primary google account so now you don't have to log into different google account and from one google account only you can use all these storage only so for example i took here around 60 gigabyte but if you want more than that like uh, 120 then you have to create around 8 google account if you need 150 then you will have to create around a 9 or 10 google account so this all work you have to do one time and after that you can enjoy the storage of 150 or more than that for absolutely free so that's all guys for today hopefully you enjoyed the trick and found this information useful if yes make sure that you hit the like subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye